everyone and welcome back to another lecture of our safety by crash course series so in this video we'll be discussing about how we can use system images in our project so apple has provided some system icons by default for for us to use and we will be seeing how we can use it in our project so we will be discussing these three points which i have written on top of the code which is uh, adding system image then using sf symbol and then cust uh, customizing the size and color of the asset that we added so let's start by removing this code and adding an image so to add a system image we have to pass the system name and here we can pass the name of the asset that we want to use let's say i pass x mark so you will see that an x mark has appeared and it's not present in our asset folder but you can find it in the uh, you are still able to use it because this is a system icon and system icons we can use by default so you might be wondering that from where can i get this name so to get this name uh, you can just click here and click on this plus icon on the top and here there is a uh, section of symbol once you tap here you will see that there are different symbols available the one which i used was this one x mark and there are different varieties of it as you can see i use this one x mark and there are multiple like this clock patch x mark dot fill if i click on this it will get added here so you can see the size of the image is very small to increase the size we have two options one is directly provide it a font and make it large title so whatever the size of a large title is it will take that size the other one is directly using resizable on an image and then providing the frame to it let's pass the width at as 100 and height as 100 so you'll see that the image has appeared as the image is uh, I think slightly compressed so let's just give the aspect ratio and pass it fit all right so now it's looking better let's remove this one and just put down trash dot fill all right so this is how we can use it we can also change the foreground color so let's just try to do it and here we will pass the red so you can see the color has changed to red and one way is to click on this plus icon and get the system icons the other one is by using sf symbol app the beta version of which is available and this is the sf symbol app as you can see there are all the icons available category wise here so you can click on it and uh, you can even customize it like you can change the color to brown and uh, background to light rendering as automatic right you can here customize those here and this is how you can directly like if you want to use this one you can just copy the name here click on the right click on this and uh, copy name copy name and you can directly put it here all right and you can also download it and uh, use it as an asset in your projects so yeah that's it about the uh, sf symbol i will add a link in the comment section so you can use it uh, that's it about this lecture we discuss about uh, how we can add the system image how we can customize it and about the sf symbol app which you can use to browse the icons category wise so that's it for this lecture and i'll see you next one thank you